How's it going everyone? I'm Game Master 648 and welcome back to Benny in the Ink Machine. Man, it's been a really long time since I played this. The last time I played this game was back in December 31st of 2019. The bay the day when the ball drop of 2020 was about to begin in a whole new decade. The 2010s really brought us a lot of changes throughout the world. I really miss that decade. I st started going to middle school that time, finished up from 6th, 7th, and 8th grade, went to high school, I finished that, graduated, I created my YouTube channel like this, and yeah. That sort of stuff. Other stuff, I can't say. But I remember this game, you see? I remember playing this game way back in 2017, back when I was 16 years old at the time. I remember when I was going through my emails years ago, I went to my inbox and I saw an update from Game Jolt, like a recommendation for me to play this game. So when I looked at it, I saw the images, I somehow downloaded the game on my computer, played it, and it was, and I made a video of it, uploaded it to YouTube, and yeah. I did a let's play of this game back in early 2017 though, chapter one. I didn't even know that this game would become so popular that time. Dear Henry, it seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. 30 years really slips away, doesn't it? If you're going back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey Drew. You mean... Getting duped into doing it. Man... All right, Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. Yeah, back then, in early 2019, I was going through some Minecraft maps on the- I knocked out a wall or two after I left. Guess it took a few people to replace me. On the unofficial Minecraft map website, I was gonna go to horror maps to see what map I could play out in Minecraft until someone managed to recreate chapter one on the Minecraft. I did a let's play on it and uploaded that video straight to YouTube. But I never thought in a million years would my video, would that let's play video get so many views. I'm, I was, I'm somehow both proud, but at the same time, disappointed. Because in my video, I, people, you guys on my video called Minecraft Benny and the Ink Machine Chapter 1 map, which I uploaded back in February 25th of 2019, 
I was somehow eating chips, which I should not have done in my Let's Play. Yeah, that Minecraft map. I was hoping I would wait for chapter... For that Minecraft map of Benny and the Ink Machine to update. For... The creator to like... I don't know... Add, add an update to it, like... Chapter 2. The creator of the Benny and the Ink Machine Chapter 1 map is... Hold on, if the name pops up. Moving Pictures, 100%. Chapter 2, Old Songs, Zero Progress. Chapter 3, Zero Progress. Sorry for my English, I'm Ukrainian. It's by Rise YT. Oh, I can't s pronounce the person's name, username right. Sorry. Rise YT Ariana Steam. This came out in February 20th, 2019. It's a horror map. So, yeah. I mean, when I did a Let's Play on that one. I thought that the map, the video, that let's play of mine was gonna get less views like my old videos did, but it got about, wow, 97,509 views. That was so unexpected. Really. I think, while well, I did put in the hashtag Batum in the description below, so yeah. This lift could use a few dry cells. Let's see what you're hiding down there, old friend. I remember in chapter one, this room was not in chapter one back in 2017, the original chapter one. I think that the Meatly, I think the developers of this game, like the Meatly I think they're called, must have went back to chapter one to update it. It made some changes here and there like this. Man, they're improving development. Added some other rooms, which the original Chapter 1 did not have in early 2017. Always on time. I think during Chapter 2, 3, 4, and 5's development, Dimitri must have... Went back to these chapters like 1, 2, and 3 to update them. Had some new rooms to it, I think. I don't know. Oh, great, I suck.
people set us free. I remember back in 2017, you needed to purchase all these chapters on Steam Story. Yeah. Benny and the Ink Machine was added to Steam years ago. Like I said, I never thought this game was going to be so popular that year. Didn't think it was going to be played by Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, and everyone else. Alright, how do I get this to work? Yeah. It did remind other people of the old school Disney cartoons like Steamboat Willie with Mickey Mouse in it, Pete, all the other characters in the old days, in the 20s. You know, back when they made Willie, Who put this here? Oh my god. Joey, what were you doing? So I'm guessing the voice is the creator himself, the meat Lee. As much as I enjoy Bendy, I think Bendy in the Dark Revival was the greatest. At this point, I don't get what Joey's plan is for this company. Yeah, Yummy, dude. Sure I mean Yummy boy! Great, someone moved Bendy. Sorry, Boris. Who's laughing now?
book, the jaw, and the music. the joy let's go somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. Look at that animation. It looks a lot like the old school Mickey Mouse films from the 20s. It's like Steamboat Willie. I mean, I've watched that one on YouTube. That one was funny. dog I should have said.
February 10th, 2017. Chapter 1, Moving Pictures. Yeah, I've played the original one back in 2017, February, on Game Jolt. I did manage to buy the Chapter 2 of it. 3 and 4. Chapter 5. I don't think I have bought that one. The complete edition came out after Chapter 5 was out. One day later. Inspired by Bioshock game series. The fiction of Joey Drew it's set in. In the months following its release, the game quickly gaining large following from exposure on platforms like YouTube and Twitch, and eventually was approved through Steam Greenlight in mid-2017. Yeah, so because of people making videos of it on YouTube and Twitch, Amazing. The game takes place roughly 10 years after the events of the original. So Benny in the Dark Revival takes place 10 years after Bendy and the Ink Machine. Yeah, this was the room we landed in, in the original chapter one, but the Meatly suddenly moved this location and added the expanded areas we've never been in. This will definitely come in handy. Okay. 